So that is uh, President Putin there that we just heard from addressing the nation after this force a dramatic uh, event. We had uh, Yevgeny uh, Prigozhin throwing down a challenge to the Russian military and heard uh, President Putin there saying we are fighting for our right to uh, remain as a sovereign nation in Russia. He said any action that divides Russia is betrayal. Betrayal is where it means uh, several times. He also said that uh, those who uh, were engaging in this were betraying the very soldiers, the Wagner fighters who had given their lives for a new Russia. Uh, he talked about personal ambitions taking over and the fact that any internal mutiny uh, was a blow to Russia. He said 
past, he also uh, talked about the response. He said our actions will be harsh. Those who have chosen treason, terrorism, and blackmail will be punished. Uh, he mentioned that armed forces have been mobilized as well as additional anti-terrorist measures are taken, uh, particularly to uh, take back control of uh, some of those areas, including Moscow on Don. So attempts going on there to restore order as what we've heard from uh, President Putin there. Well, uh, we have, of course, uh, been following uh, this story since uh, uh, this serious escalation of infighting between Russia's Wagner Mercenary Group and the Russian military leader. Tanks and armored vehicles have taken up position in the southern Russian city of Moscow on Don, as it is that to be on the anti Wagner Mercenary Group. Russia is keeping everyone into fighting. Now, they have been videos on social media showing heavily armed and in uniform around the government building, the Wagner Box, the Infinity Version, Chinese video of itself, which is signed the local military headquarters in Moscow, which is one of the areas that uh, President Putin was mentioning. He says that all military installations in the city are under control and working normally. Well, earlier, the Kremlin ordered the arrests of the Russians, whose men have been fighting alongside Russian forces in Ukraine after the accused the Russian commission of carrying out a deadly missile strike on Wagner troops in Ukraine. That's something the that defense ministry denies. And as we heard as well, for President Putin, anti terror measures have been introduced in Moscow, with armored vehicles seen on the streets, and the M4 highway connecting Moscow and Rostov has been closed. Well, Pogosian announced what he called a martial justice day, but anyone who's doing his way to be in the but he says that this is not good. A reminder there of what has been happening. Pogosian has vowed to go all the way and topple the Russian military leadership, but he denies uh, that he was carrying out a coup. Russian state TV's Channel 1 interrupted radio programming to broadcast an emergency news bulletin. Recapping official statements about the Pogosian matter and stating that uh, President Putin was being kept informed of developments. Well, Russian General Vladimir Alexeyev described Mr. Pogosian's actions as madness, whilst the deputy commander of the Russian Ukraine campaign, Sergei Sarkin, told Vladimir soldiers to stand down. This really is extraordinary. I mean, the tragedy uh, on the American victory, uh, sailing through the archipelago of Japan, uh, on the American victory, uh, sailing through the archipelago. Extraordinary. I mean, you're catching me uh, on the American victory, uh, sailing through the archipelago of uh, Alaska. And uh, I'm astonished, to be honest with you. Uh, I've been following Prigozhin uh, for a while, and he is uh, truly a character in the finest sense of the word. But uh, we're uh, we're seeing a potential here of uh, of Russia imploding uh, with the civil war, and we don't want that. No one wants it, and uh, maybe that will be a void. But this is uh, this is really uh, a really really interesting historical time for Russia, and we don't want that. And we don't want that. We're seeing a potential here of uh, of Russia imploding uh, with the civil war, and of uh, Russia imploding. Uh, but uh, we're uh, we're seeing a potential here of uh, of Russia imploding, uh, of uh, of Russia imploding, uh, with, of uh, of Russia imploding uh, with the civil war, uh, with the civil war. And, of Russia imploding uh, with the civil war. Of Russia imploding uh, with the civil war. Of Russia imploding uh, with the civil war. And we don't want that. Of, uh, of Russia imploding uh, with the civil war. And we don't want that. War. And we don't want that. No one wants it. No one wants it. No one wants it. Like, uh, with the civil war. Or of, uh, of Russia imploding uh, with the civil war. We're, uh, we're seeing a potential here of uh, we're, uh, we're seeing a potential here. We're, uh, we're seeing a potential here. Of, and uh, maybe that will be avoided. But this is uh, this is really uh, a really really interesting. This is really uh, this is really uh, this is really. Uh, 
This is really this This is really uh it, and uh maybe that will be avoided, but this of uh of Russia imploding of uh of Russia imploding Russia imploding Russia imploding Russia imploding uh war and of Russia imploding uh of, uh, of Russia imploding uh, with the civil war, and we don't want that. No one uh, don't want that. Don't want that. Don't want that. No one uh, wants. Don't want that. But uh, we're uh, we're seeing a potential here. Of, uh, we're uh, we're seeing a potential here of a. Uh, and we don't want that. No one wants it, and uh, maybe that would be a void, but this is, uh, this is really, uh, 